We're in Southern California at the 2023 launch of the Contour X, a new helmet from Arai. And it is light and quiet and full of features, and it's a rad, rad helmet. So the day's been really cool. We started at Bike Shed and had a great breakfast, got the product launched, so we got to find out all the details about Arai's innovation for the new helmet and how much protection they put into it, plus all the extra benefits and features that it comes with, including a lighter helmet that also protects you as well as all their other helmets. For me, riding on the streets, something kind of new for me. I've been racing professionally now for 18 years, been riding motorcycles for probably 27 years, so uh, street riding something that's taken over in the last seven years for me and uh, never really had to think about how comfortable a helmet is because for us on the track, I make it as tight as I possibly can. So I've rode in some really uncomfortable race helmets and some uncomfortable street helmets and not just with the Contour X but with all the Arai helmets, I've never really had a problem being comfortable on the road. So that for me is, is the best thing, even with the Cardo headset in, you know, taking up extra space in the helmet, it still is really comfortable for me. So. so we're at the Gasolina Cafe, our lunch stop for the press introduction just north of Los Angeles for the new Contour X. Uh, we had our first ride on the helmet and luckily enough we had got cold, we got rain, we got a little adverse conditions to try and test the helmet on how well it works when it's cold and rainy. Uh, that was good and then the sun's coming out so we should have a chance to see how it works in the kind of middle temperature range and then hopefully it'll get warmer this afternoon we can open up the vents and see how it works. Immediately when we got on the highway you could tell it was kind of blustery and of course you're passing in vehicles, big vehicles like big tractor trailers and usually when you are tucked in in the, in the road race bike your, your head is always playing right where the highest forces are of that wind right around the tops of the windscreen so you definitely feel that things get knocked around quite a bit and here I am riding a, a basically an MT10 standard bike without a windscreen at all and yeah, I thought it was incredibly stable. It was one of the first things that stood out to me about the helmet. Even though it's been a rainy day in Los Angeles, I think that that's been a plus because it just goes to show how good this helmet is. And you know, for me, when I put my helmet on, I don't want to think about anything else. I just want to know it's protecting me and that's, that's the comfort in an RI. You know, the, they protect you and it's just the, one less thing to worry about. You put your helmet on to go and enjoy the riding. My helmets have saved my life numerous times. I've put them to the test numerous times. Just uh, if you haven't tried an Arai helmet, if you don't want to buy an Arai helmet, don't try an Arai helmet because if you try it, you're going to love it, you're going to wind up buying it. They've come through with, with something that keeps true to their design in, in keeping the round, smooth shape right, of the helmet so that nothing can catch, no edges to catch. And, and by doing this, it's just taking more things off the top of the helmet, less things for the air to catch, actually, and move your head around. And, you know, it, it's a beautiful helmet. I'm Mike Collins, president of Le Mans Corporation. I've worked there for uh, 30 years, been riding motorcycles for over 50 years, and I'm, I'm ashamed to say until today, I had never worn a Rye helmet. You know, other than being a work of art, it's the most comfortable helmet I've ever worn, and the, the Pro Shield system was just, it's a winner. I, I love it. And after today, that may be the only helmet I wear. <laughs>